Hello everyone, welcome back to yet again another episode of First Time Watch. I know I've been doing these loads lately, uh, but basically not really got no more videos to do. I mean, there's no like collection updates. I haven't actually bought a Blu-ray in about a week, or DVD in a week. Uh, just been watching lots of films on my new Sky Movies package that I got like free with the other box and whatever. Yeah, I don't know why. Um, it's not, I won't collect Blu-rays, obviously. It's just, um, you know... Some new blockbusters I watch. I mean, the classics you watch on Blu-ray for me. Anyway, um, The Sitter, which is a film that I wasn't actually going to put on Blu-ray considering I didn't really hear the best things about it. So, today, the first time watch will be The Sitter. So, The Sitter stars uh, Jonah Hill and uh, Sam Rockwell. That's probably the only people that people would actually know. Um, yeah, that's the only people I actually know. So, Sam Rockwell was the kind of villain. Um, and Jonah Hill was, like obviously, the main the main part in it. Who like sells the film basically? Yeah, so Jonah Hill was like um, a kind of wasted, kind of uh, college student who gets kicked out for a year and just like his mum's like, I'll go and get a job. Uh, he says, No, I'm too lazy. Okay, just go and babysit the next door neighbour. So he does um, for like twenty dollars. And um, there's like one guy, one of the, there's the three kids. One's a bit like he's gay, but he doesn't like know he's gay. Uh, but you can sense it as as the film goes on. He even admits he is. There's a little girl in it uh, who like wants to be the next Beyonce or Pussycat Dolls or whatever. And then there's uh, like this guy from like the Good, the Bad, the Ugly, like Tuco from the Good, the Bad, the Ugly, uh, like a Mexican dude with cool black hair and whatever. So he has to babysit these three kind of weird kids. And um, as it goes on, uh, crazy shit happens. He, he, he's, like, he's babysitting them and they're getting a bit out of hand. He gets a call from his, like, fuck buddy. Um, say, go get cocaine and then uh, I'll have sex with you in New York. So he goes all the way up to New York from, like, I think New Jersey or the Bronx or whatever. And, yeah, they just... It's crazy, crazy, you know, drug busts and um, drug dealings gone wrong with Sam Rockwell and crazy gang fights and uh, different random stuff like being accused of a pedo at one point in the sh in the shopping centre when he's with this girl um, and he's been accused of being a pedophile and he, goes and he hijacks his dad's um, jewellery store and there's uh, goes in, breaks and uh, gate crashes restaurants and parties and it's just a crazy film and actually surprisingly a really enjoyable comedy film uh, honestly I, I enjoyed this one I thought Jonah Hill did a really good job uh, I've been looking, viewing loads of his films, and actually he's got much skinnier. He was actually, this was like his last role, as he was like really fat, I think he was. You know, uh, this or Moneyball, one of them two, you know, since like 21 Jump Street, uh, The Watch, uh, stuff like that. So yeah, really, really did like this film. Really, for, I don't think, um, like, I might buy it on Blu-ray, but I think it's a good film to like watch. I, it'll be on TV, like... Um, Later on, I reckon. Yeah, I actually really enjoyed The Sitter. I thought it was a good film. Uh, Jonah Hill did a did a good job as his comedic role. Um, you know, Sam Rockwell was really, really good in every film he does. Really underrated actor. Uh, the kids did, like, a good job of their acting roles. But, you know, whatever. I, I thought it was a good film. I enjoyed The Sitter. So, yeah, guys, thanks for watching this first time watch. And I'll see you later. Bye.